and we are glad you're with us on a glorious evening here in Norman, Oklahoma, as the calendar turns to October. Onside kick to begin the game, and a loose ball still fought for as it goes the necessary 10, and a wild scramble as they try to get everybody off, and Ball State looks like they've recovered. Out of the gun and looking right, and a comeback route is caught at the 45-yard line, and the give, and they're not going to get it. Win against Missouri. Snap back. Swing it right. And in the flat, Dominic Whaley upended at the 25-yard line right at the first down marker. Oklahoma on third down and two. Here's Jones. Swings it left. Whaley's open. Nice catch across the 40 and pushed out of bounds. Palma goes quickly to roll out right by Jones. Jazz Reynolds at the sideline with the catch. Jones' first incompletion, now will throw to the hash mark, and that's caught. Kenny Stills, first catch of the night, first down. Cards of play. Another quick snap, they try to blitz, it's picked up, wide open, Stills inside the 10, and slung to the ground at the six-yard line, first and goal for Oklahoma. And the fake to Whaley, and wide open to the end zone, touchdown, James Hanna. Second down and 11. And winning rolling, and they're not going to get much on that one as the Sooners pursuit of the football. Winning with time, and that's incomplete. You know, Broyles has such soft hands. As soon as I say this, he'll fumble it, but it's like it's never even a consideration of whether he'll catch a punt or not. Lovely kick. Back to the 22-yard line and a pirouette by Broyles. Spins out of one tackle and then lost the ball. And Ball State pointing as if they have it. Winning pass behind his intended receiver, but caught inside the 20-yard line. That's a pretty good adjustment on the play by Connor Ryan. Winning will throw it short, incomplete. And Ball State takes the turnover and turns it in to three points. Blitz off the corner. And oh, nice grab. Stills on the crossing route at the 45 yard line. You can do that all night. Jones again. And there's another leaping catch by Stills to the 39 yard line. Bootleg to the right. Jones on the move. And there's Broyles inside the 30. Great. Fake it to Clay. All day again. And this one is incomplete. Stills fell at the 11 yard line, but he was wide open again. Second down and 10 for Oklahoma. Jones quickly out to the left, and Broyles is met immediately. Andre Dawson right there, right now. Two and one, here we go with Jones to throw. And now flushed out, and he'll have to throw it away. Soccer player from Pierce High School in Richardson, Texas. His second game. In a 27-yarder, the first week against Tulsa, and he's got plenty of distance on this one. Winning back to throw. And a quick swing out to the right. Nice cut by Edwards at the 45. And run down from behind by Lewis. And winning with good protection. Throws short caught. Broken tackle. And very close to the first down. Toriel Gibson. Keith winning the quarterback. And a handoff. And breaking into the secondary is Dwayne Donegan. The ball stayed in the red zone for the second time tonight. And Donegan is... Stop at the line of scrimmage. Jamarcus McFarland just blew that play up right at the line of scrimmage. Ball control drive. Just what Pete Lebo has drawn up. Here's Donegan stutter steps inside the 15 to the 14-yard line. Proctor with another tackle. Show the blitz and a little shovel pass inside. Jamel Smith not going to get anything done there. And this one from 31. And true. Kept the ball, and Oklahoma needs to respond. And Whaley again breaks a tackle across the 20. And across the 30, and he's got a first down. And some penalties, and ball moving by Ball State. Here's a swing pass. Brennan Clay across the 40-yard line. Jones, and the handoff to Whaley. And he breaks through the tackle of the 30. He got himself to the 25. They run quickly here again. 
to the short side of the field as it's cut back inside. Whaley down the left sideline. It'll score. Touchdown Sooners. Snap back, and here's Whaley. Bat it in the air, and it's intercepted. And the first interception this season against Ball State's Keith Whaley. Tony Jefferson coming out of there, and Oklahoma in business right around the 10-yard line. It's just clicked well for Oklahoma, and they'll see if they can cap it here. And it's trying to get play fake, and Stills get it down. Walk the linebacker up, waggle right. And that is caught across midfield. Willie Sneed with the catch into Oklahoma territory. Play action and a lot of time for Wedding. And he's got no one in the vicinity. Did Jefferson come down with that one? Yes, Whoa. he did. Wow. What a play. Oh, hell of a catch. What a play by Tony Jefferson for his second interception in as many series. The first one was a gifting, and Roy, this one, nothing short of spectacular athletic ability. Wow, that was amazing. That was a great one-handed catch. That kind of reminds me of uh, a couple of years ago when uh, Brandon Everidge caught it one-handed on the sideline. I think we were playing uh, Kansas. That is terrific coverage there. Terrific coverage. It looked as though there was a man open, and Harris had good coverage. And the fans getting a chance to see it on the big screen here in the stadium just going nuts. I tell you, Roy, there's a lot of drills that prepare you for something like that, right? No. <laughs> <laughs> Not at all. Roy Fitch in motion. And clear it out for him. And Fitch will get it. He's wide open down the left sideline. 40. And he stepped out of bounds. No, he did not step out of bounds. Inside the 30. And the 28 yard for the call and here is the hand on Whaley oh what a gorgeous move inside the five and down to the three yard line and a gain of 16 yards he's got some jiggle there highlighted by the two Jefferson interceptions here's a handoff to Whaley and an easy Oklahoma touchdown five yards on the play out to the Ball State 29 yard line here's winning another batted ball and another interception for Oklahoma and it's another interception for Tony Jefferson Three consecutive possessions, three interceptions. Don't know that I've ever heard of that happening. Have you? I'd have to think long and hard. But for the second time in three possessions, it's a batted ball as the hands get up. And it's R.J. Washington who gets the left arm up in the air, Dean, and Tony Jefferson again, right place, right time. Well, Bobby Jack Wright works with those defensive ends and talks about if you can't get to the quarterback, get your hands up if the ball's going up. The Oklahoma football team for 2011. Here's the snap back to Jones. And looking left and wide open! Inside the 10, reaching and scoring Ryan Broyles touchdown. 27 yards. He's saying, Coach, don't make me throw it left. Well, he's looking, he's left, looking that way. And there it goes, and it's incomplete. Oh! <laughs> well, excuse me, I called that a little too soon. <laughs> that might have been the easiest catch of all. Excellent protection. And out to the left. And across the sideline, out of bounds, Kenny Stills. Here's Jones again. And the crossing group, that one's intercepted. That one got away from him. And intercepted by Kyle Hoke. And Jones to throw. And whips it over the middle. And a nice crossing route caught. Jazz Reynolds across midfield. And he breaks free at the 30. Reynolds is tripped up finally inside the 15-yard line. Andre Dawson, a touchdown saving tackle for Ball State. In the first quarter, banked it in off the left upright. And this one solidly threw from 30 yards and a 41. Was it? It was no good. Excuse me. Play fake to Whaley and a big one over the middle of Royals and running away from everybody to the 10 to the corner. He's got it. Touchdown, Oklahoma. 64 yards. This year was a record setter for him. Winning in trouble. He is hit and ball is ball incomplete. Incomplete. And the fake to Williams. And down the right side, Reynolds all by himself, and he's going to stroll on in. Touchdown, Sooners. 
outstanding. Keith Wedding on first down, and the fumble, oh, fumble. and it's picked up, and it's going to be run in. Tom Ward going to run it in That's for a touchdown. Good. And there's your defense, Roy. He needs as many reps as he can get. I mean, you don't want him on the field here much more, but even he was rusty in a couple of ball games. And he wants nothing but the best on every single play. Here's Wedding will throw it out. Look out! Oh, man! And Jawan Edwards paid a terrible price for having his head turned. Well, smart of him to not go head first. That was a vicious hit. And Edwards is a big man, so he took the hit pretty well. Gabe Lynn played a lot last week. Jamel Fleming was injured. Did not play. Great hit. Third down. And here's one pass batted away again. Ron L. Lewis got that one. And Brandon Williams on the carry. Right up the middle, and he's got his first first down as a suitor out to the 28-yard line for 13 yards. Catch passing the running back. It should be noted. Torian Henderson from right. Texas Tech in 2005. And here's Williams again, spinning across the 45. And the handoff to Williams, and he can't get away. It's a big kick for him, I really think. And the kick on the way. And he got it. School for several years. At least for their quarterbacks. But here comes Bell. He'll tuck it under and cut to his right and have a first down. The big teams we've been talking about, you cannot be one dimension. Here is Bell's throw, and that is caught. Really a tradition unlike any other. One of the great scenes in all of sports, not just college football. That pass caught by Orsman. The final play of the game. As the clock runs down, Oklahoma now 4-0, 39 straight wins at home, a 62-6 public of the Ball State Cardinals. Very solid overall performance by the Sooners. They're concerned about a couple of injuries. Otherwise, solid on both sides of the football, and Landry Jones puts up big numbers. Five touchdown passes. 425 yards, Ryan Broyles becomes the all-time Big 12 leading receiver. As the Sooners get it done tonight in the most convincing of fashions.